Ahoy and welcome back to Broadside Gaming. So today we're taking a look at the Psyker. I've had some awesome feedback from some of our subscribers, especially 88 Spin. He's given me some really good advice on this, so uh, let's jump in and take a look at the changes. So this is a Gun Psyker build. We've switched the weapon out to the Maccabian Mark IV Dueling Sword with Shred and Uncanny Strikes, Maniac Damage and Extra Crit. I'm quite happy with the perks on this because I actually wanted more crit. This build is just all about stacking that crit. And we've got the Mark 6D Recon Lasgun with Maniac Damage and 1.5 Stamina, which is useless. We wanted Flak there. But, you know, we get what we're given. Blessings-wise, we're going with Dum Dum and Infernus. And this is for stacking close-range damage on a repeated hit and getting those burn stacks out on crit. As for the Curios, we're going with Toughness, Damage Resistant Gunners, Extra Health and Combat Ability Regeneration. Max Health with more Health, Combat Ability Regeneration, Damage Resistant Gunners. And Toughness with more Toughness, Combat Ability Regeneration and 12% Stamina Regeneration. This is just to help with dodging and blocking. Right, talent-wise, let's have a look. So we're grabbing Metal, Perfect Timing, Warp Expenditure. Now, Perfect Timing apparently does help with this. I'm not sure how accurate that is, but it says it does. So we're going with this for the moment. We're picking up Perilous Combustion, then Brain Rupture, going into Kinetic Flare, Wildfire, Psychonetics Aura, down here to Precise. Uh, Precises, yeah, extra crit. Sorry, I mush mouth today. Empathic evasion, anticipation, scry's gaze, precognition, warp speed, and endurance. So this is. I'll explain a bit about this in a second. Then warp rider, because we're going to be at high perils all the time. Kinetic deflection down into true aim. Disrupt Destiny, Perfectionism, and Cruel Fortune. So, with this build, we want to spam Scry's Gaze as much as possible. We don't care how high the perils go, because we can't over-exceed the perils in this. And we're using Kinetic Flare with Brain Rupture, just for extra brain bursts while we're firing, and also if we need to snipe an enemy at range. Mostly, what we're doing this for is this. So, we come out, we press F, there are many on the and we just start laying down continuous heavy fire. And as you can see, the perils go up and up and up and up and up. But because we're not actually using any warp abilities, it doesn't matter to us. It can hit 100. just does nothing. As you can see we're spreading that soul fire around and we're also laying down fire stacks from our gun. So basically this is a horrifically nasty build. You can't quite hose down crushes like you can on the veteran so I probably wouldn't bother. I mean you can if you want to, it's a bit of a waste of ammo. As you can see, even using the sword, we hit 100, the game goes, oh, you're not using any warp stuff, so you're fine. And as you can see, everything we kill, well, elites-wise, reduces the Scryer's Gaze cooldown. And this is on Damnation Prep, so that's what all the breakpoints are for these. It's just a very, very, very nasty build. And uh, I'm quite pleased with it, to be honest. It works a lot better than the uh, pistol build I came up with earlier. But if there are any improvements you guys can see, please do let me know. I'm always happy to tweak builds and work on them uh, when advice is given. So, you know, let me know what you think. And if you're enjoying this sort of build or these sorts of videos, please do like, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. It really does help us out. And uh, I'll just see you all for the next one. So take it easy. See you later.